the Fornsky. I'm gonna look, I'm gonna look that judge up to see how they look. You know, we like to see if we got a black judge, white judge, whatever. But that sounds like you should know. He said, in this case, I find the presumption that he is not rebutted. So Sean Combs will be detained. There has been significant violence, weapons I told around, you. coercion of witnesses, and even gentle coercion that could be effective. The type of behavior we're talking about happens behind closed doors. I I thank your family for coming, but I cannot release him. Um, I told you, bro. What I think, bro, the fact that he contacted those people hurt him bad. Mm. Out of all that shit, that's what hurt him bad. Because, see, you did that when you wasn't facing criminal time. Wow. Now they talking about this shit carry life? No. What won't you do? Now, it, remember, they got a they got a conference, which is not necessarily a court day, but you know, clearly, you know, I'm, I'm guessing they're going to set some type of timeline. I, that's I figured out what the conference is, you know, because obviously they got to set a timeline for when the defense is available, prosecutor is available, when they could do exchange of discovery, um, have the formal. Uh, uh, well, I guess this was a formal arraignment. I don't know if it was a formal arraignment, but he definitely entered a plea. It's basically almost scheduling out the trial that the judge could approve the dates and stuff like that. So they're gonna come back with that, which means D Diddy's gonna sit in jail for at least a week. Um, don't know when. No, gonna... no, I, no, 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 no. What happened? Diddy gonna be in that motherfucker for two, three years fighting this thing, bro. You think Diddy's gonna be in jail for this whole time? Well, I mean, well, well I'm, I'm, I, again, I don't know if they let him bail out. I, I don't know if. Well, you know they're gonna try other bail bail applications, right? Like. No, 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 no. You got to go to the judge. That's the feds. Yeah. That's on the judge. Yeah. I don't okay. give a fuck where you go. That's on the judge, bro. That's the feds. No, no, I agree. But, 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 but you know, you know, they, they try to do it. Obviously, this was state. They try to do it with Thug. They're like, oh, things has changed. We could, we could, we could verify that, you know, uh, oh, yeah, you guys think he's going to contact witnesses. We'll make sure he does have a phone or something. They, they're going to try, right? But I still think that. If the judge denied it on this, he probably not gonna let him out. It, like you can't change your mind. Um, what, what situations could change for you to believe that? If you thought that you're you're not gonna let him out because he's gonna contact witnesses, why would you ever? What's change gonna your change? Mind? What he yeah. gonna do? Yeah, the guns are still there. Him trying to coerce a witness is still there. Yeah, the violence is still there. The intimidation is still there. It's all there in the in the charges. Um, do, do you think did he? Uh, is shedding a tear, maybe not necessarily in court, but it gets back to that detention facility holding. That the nigga ain't gonna eat till Friday. What do you mean? What? Yeah, bro, his appetite is gone. You, got, bro, listen. Oh, yeah, yeah, I, I remember what it was when I was twelve, right? You talking about fifty-four year old man? He'd be fifty-five in November. Act. This nigga is used to the best of the best. He is he he hasn't had any restrictions. He don't wait in line. He don't he flies private. The people wait on him hand and foot. He got his pick of the litter of this, that, that, or the other. Right? Now, in the cell, when I'm coming out, all right, it's Wednesday, we bring you out Friday for 30 minutes. What? Yeah. Hey, by the way, by the way. I can't watch TV? No. But, Here goes the phone. I, I, I'll mean to cut you off. His lawyers and the prosecutors walked out the, the courthouse. His lawyers spoke to the media. Hold on. Let me try to get you. I, I want you to hear. His lawyers are addressing the press a lot. I ain't gonna lie. Some of us. Okay, hold on. Uh, chat, my bad. I'm just fast forwarded. What? They had two cameras out, two entrances. Trying to get to it. Anyway. Hold on, almost there. Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. All right. So, uh, so this was this was the first step. We have we have uh, we have a bail appeal scheduled for tomorrow, three thirty, in front of Judge Carter, the district judge assigned to this case. Okay, so so they have a bail appeal for tomorrow. It's going in front of a different judge, which is a district judge that's assigned to the case. You know, the magistrate judge just does the first appearance. So they're hoping that the other judge tomorrow um, gives a different opinion. But, I mean. So this is what you talking about, Ak, about him possibly have made some friends. Shit. Yeah. This is what you talking about. And I'm going to be real, right? We're going to see if this next situation, they grant him bail. You, you was absolutely right. 
I knew they wasn't gonna give me. I knew they wasn't gonna give me no bell today, right? Now we we know he's at home. I knew they wasn't gonna give me no bell today. But if he goes to this next hearing and gets a bell, act he was on point, mm. straight up. Yeah, yeah, let me hear the rest of his. Um, I think that we, we 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 made the points that we've been wanting to make. Um, I think it came out. Mr. Combs is a fighter. He's gonna fight this to the end. He's innocent. Uh, he came to New York to.